All right, guys, so welcome back to Scum. So before I head back to try and find where Frank could be, I made one last trip over at the MC because you'll remember I did a trade with somebody called Alex, which got me a katana and some attachments for my rifle. Now, I actually got a lot more in that deal, and I know that. So I did go out looking, trying for anything that she was looking for, which I believe was the metal arrows, I think it was. I ended up trading those, and then we worked out more of a deal where I would tag along with them help them do something called a kill box and then we were open to more negotiations for something i was really interested in now throughout this episode you are going to see some new people i'm told that these guys were going through some kind of initiation in order to be a prospect for the mc not all of them but most of them i also really wanted to try and push my luck with ranger he was the person that we met last time who i believe was the one that started the whole mc and was at sergeant at arms level he is now the president of the entire mc i really wanted to know how far i could push my luck with these guys and see what happened either way like i say we're going to be tagging along with a lot of new people today we're going to try and do a kill box i want to give you guys a bit of a heads up though Throughout the past couple of episodes, I've been running into a weird bug which is causing the game to lock up and eventually crash and it's coming up with fatal error. I have no idea what's causing it and if anybody knows how to fix it, let me know in the comments below. It happens a couple of times throughout this episode and in one particular spot, the worst timing of all but we'll catch up to that. Either way, I just wanted to bring you guys up to speed on what it is you're looking at because there's quite a few people in this episode, some new faces, so at least you know what we're attempting to do. No. I don't know what it is. Everybody here has been so nice, but you, you, I've got a problem with. How me? What did I do? I didn't do anything wrong. And you know what? I've just eaten all those vegetables. I didn't even check if they were off. That's how much trust I have in you, and I shouldn't. Uh, oh, they, I checked. Those they were, they were fine. They were good. Yep. Yep. I, I, got I don't don't believe you, Alex. Uh, I, I won't let them poison palette. you. Oh, look, 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 look at this. <laughs> oh! <gasps> oh. I agree. I agree. Told you that Thunder Buns had a trigger finger. Yeah. Oh. There it is. It, it was mostly it was mostly just towards Ranger. This is how it starts. Tag. So he tagged me and I was it and that. You see that? No respect. No respect. That's how we play tag. That's how you play tag. You fire flares at each other. Yeah. yeah. We could have somebody literally craft lockpicks while we're in there, though, if we have enough people. See, 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 Alex always thinking. Hmm? Alex always thinking. So we could dedicate people to protection detail and then somebody literally just makes lockpicks while you're lockpicking. That is enough. I mean, would everybody okay. here be down to go? To I think your box? voice box is broken. Yeah, I think you should uh, lay down and uh, I see if it, I go to see for a little bit. Uh, talking about subject. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think everyone here would be down for one. Uh, do you want to come with us, Mason? Uh, Trial two. What is a kill box? <laughs> yeah, you got it. Well, with the name, I guess it's a box where uh, if you you're not prepared enough and don't have enough supplies, you die. I'm telling you guys, you should organize some kind of meeting and overthrow him. We literally just appointed him. Ah, there's nothing saying that you can't have another meeting, though. Actually, we literally just had a meeting um, to upgrade a prospect and to recruit a new prospect. Which, by the way, Wait, we need to get that set up for you. Uh, negative. Not right now. Uh, I'm on a, a, a quest to save my friend right now, but um, maybe in the future. Your friend, um, just to be sure, um, maybe I've seen him. I maybe, maybe not. But um, what's his name? And yeah, I don't think you ever said like? his name. His name's Frank, and uh, he suffers from blackouts. So we'll we'll just bed down for the night, and then I'll wake Wait up. And sometimes he's there, sometimes he's not. Does he sometimes say silly things that don't make sense? Oh, very much so. Yeah, he's uh, he's got a habit of that. And if you have any buttons or levers or anything like that, he will press them all day, no matter what they do. Um, I think I might have seen him actually. I didn't. I didn't ask his name because I'm an idiot. But he, I saw him at a we weapons factory. Don't know if it's him for sure. But um, he was talking about how there was like a plague and stuff, 
and he was asking me why I wasn't wearing a mask. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not Frank. No, 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 no. I think I bumped into that guy, though. Um, and I'm okay. sorry to say that I think he's dead. Friend. What? Okay, so right now, we're on our way to do a kill box. And there's quite a few of us. I'm tagging along with Goblin, who <laughs> apparently drives. And Alex, who we did the deal with before. And apparently some new people as well, which are the new prospects for the MC. So we'll see what that's all about. I'm, I'm a little bit worried about doing this. I think I'm really... I think I'm really undergeared for this, but I guess we'll see. I'll show you guys what I've got. I'm rocking just a couple of mags for the M9. And then if I have to, I'll fall back on the uh, 22. I think what I'm going to do is let these guys clear most of this because I don't really... Oh, he brought some more people along. I don't really have the ammunition to, to spare here. Should have really had one of those. A bow. God damn, that's loud. The snaps on that ammunition. So cool, though. There's the main bunker. So they do use the flare strat too. God damn, look at that thing that Alex has got. Look at that. MK18 with that scope. So cool. I don't remember coming across that scope, by the way. I don't know what it was. So far, I don't hear any beeps. Okay, Rebel and Subject are gonna hang back. They're, they're injured, so... Okay. They're gonna hang back to the heel. We can, we can wait for them. It's no problem. One left. You wanna hear it? Uh... I hear a beeper. Oh, this could be bad. Yeah, try to just uh sit in a position and then like we just sit right there. Uh, we'll loot the actual bunker later. We're gonna save our space for the these guys know what they're doing. Pretty tactical. Just gonna cover the uh, cover the rear. Goblins getting bloodthirsty. Look at that. Look at all that light. Just because of the torches too. Listen to that. Back. Oh my god, that was so close. Did anybody hurt? Hey, okay, Mark? Yeah, yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. When we get inside, we are going to rotate around Ranger. He's going to be working on the locks. What we're going to do is we're going to be backs against the wall, and we are going to hold position. This way, we're not accidentally shooting our teammates, all right? Um, we're not going to strafe. We're going to keep our backs to the wall. Um, if anybody at any time gets so injured that we need to leave, say it. We're not going to have anybody die on this run. Got it. Yeah, call about when you're reloading. Dear this is Killbot, a oh. place where we make your dreams <clears throat> come yeah, your gas mask on, guys. Gas mask on. I hope you don't die too early and spoil our family telly time. Ooh. I'm seeing a door. Holy shit. Right, audience. So let's make it more fun, shall we?
Ouais. I think I'm just gonna hold with the rest of the guys. Oh, he's electrocuting him. Oh, look at that. Five and a half on the clock. Five and a half. Like that. <laughs> that voice is really cool. Oh, gas mask. There we go. That's why we needed it. On your right. Nice, nice. I'm gonna check these because I'm not sure everybody did. Yeah, look. Somebody died? Is she okay? I'm open the last turn. Oh, that is the worst fatal error to get. Oh my god. 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 Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dead. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, that happened. Basically, if you weren't sure what just happened there, I crashed from a fatal error, tried to load back into the kill box. I even waited to see if the thing would reset. It didn't, and I instantly died when I logged back in. So I'm not going to die to that because that's kind of BS. I'm going to RP that Mason slipped out through a vent and try and get back to the compound. <laughs> I'm actually really upset that that happened because that was going so well too. It's the second time today that I've had that fatal error crash. I don't know how to fix that. If anybody knows, <laughs> let me know in the comments. Oh my God, guys. You're never going to believe this. Oh, he's naked. Yeah. So listen, <laughs> crazy story, okay? So this is what happened. The kill box, I blacked out. Something happened. I think it was the flashing lights. Either way, I managed to squeeze through a vent. I had to take all my gear off, so we may have to go in there and get my gear back. Thoughts? I don't uh, think we can. Yeah. We need, a, we need a key card for it. So, on a scale of... One, two, that going really bad. <sighs> it went really bad. No, it didn't. Honestly, <sighs> it, really it, it didn't do that bad. Oh, it went really bad. Bun Bunny died, did. I mean, realistically, we knew we were going in underprepared in terms of resources. You did? Um, yeah, we, we did. We, are, we knew this. We already had a discussion about it. But that, 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 that didn't affect why um, Bunny got knocked out and you lost your stuff. Realistically, that was just bad luck. Uh, there was a lot of people in there, which the more people introduces more chaos. It reduces the time on the clock when we start. So we, we knew it was going to be kind of chaotic, but we were just trying to, you know, see what we can get. See, here's the thing, Alex. Until you felt like a slug. Slippery slug. Slivering through the vents of a kill box with gas and lasers and, and undead things crawling through the same vents. I don't think you'd say that was a good time. You caught through shit to get to freedom? What did you say? That you crawled through shit to get to freedom? Barely. Redemption? 
I, I literally had to take everything off in order to fit through that vent. Like, it was that or nothing. You're way faster than me, goblin. <laughs> Hold up. Wait, where did you go? Oh. Wait, Goblin, is this where you sleep? Cabin at home. This is your home? <laughs> it's got a massive house. So much land and he just stays here. Oh. Damn, Goblin is ri- I can't take that. Oh, no, 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 Goblin, Goblin, Goblin. Hold, hold on to that for me. I'm, I might need your help with something in a few days. Is that okay? Captain Hope. Thank you, Goblin. I'll, I'll bring loads of fish for you. Okay, we'll, we'll have a good, a good meal. I, um, I might need your help with something really important though. Oh yeah, thank you though, buddy. Got a very serious proposition for you. Um, I'm told you are one of the only few people on this entire island that owns a ghillie suit. What's it going to take for me to get that uh, prite from your hands? Specifically a green one. Ah, oh, that's, that's actually a really good question. i tell you what. Bring me, like, five big toolboxes. Five big toolboxes. 20 and advanced yeah, lockpicks. Okay, that's that's harder, but like, <laughs> yeah, five big or ten small. Five big or ten small, got it. And then you'll trade that for a green ghillie suit. Will you keep it on ice for me, or are you gonna are you gonna trade it with someone else in the meantime? Uh, I have a I have a couple of spares. Oh, okay, nice. So that's the full uh, ghillie suit, right? Top and bottom. Yeah. Don't never tell yeah, them. Yeah, top and bottom. Inventory. Everything's like, you only have the last one, okay? I also have it in yeah, white. Yeah, it's, it's the last one. It's the, yeah, there's only one pair of each. There's only one <laughs> green and one yellow. She just we said she has it in pink. white, too. No, no, yeah, yeah, white yeah. And we only have one. Well. One of each. Are you having any blackouts today? Uh, if I had any blackouts today? Are you having any? Do you plan on having any blackouts? I mean, I could have a blackout. Oh, no. No more blackouts. Okay, I'm sick to death of searching this island for you. <laughs> I don't know where you go to. I don't know when it happened. But I've not seen you in at least a week. Where have you been? I mean, I mean, I kind of don't know. Uh, I woke up. So pretty much, we went to sleep. And I woke up at the dam. Have you been to the dam? I know of it. But I've not been there yet, no. Yeah, there's a dam in C2. Okay. I woke up on the ledge of that. I thought... <laughs> don't laugh, this is serious. Woke I, up on the I ledge. Thought, I woke up on the ledge and I thought you were down there. It's like you, you you fell down or something like that. I didn't know if you were alive or not. So I've been terrified this whole time. Wait, and so you, you ended up at C2? Yeah, I, that's where I woke up. So you went from... The east side of A0, which is where we set up camp on that coast. And you somehow managed to black out and end up at C2. Yep. Did you have the right and clothing? I, yeah, this, this is like the, the thing that I have on right now, more or less, that's... I had my raincoat on and then I woke up. Did you have food? Did you have water and stuff? Yeah, I was all good, <laughs> except I had no clue where you were. That's and, and then I had to make my oh, it's like my way down here. I've been, uh, it's, it's fucking, it's, it's been hard, dude. I may have a way of finding out if we can treat your blackouts. I don't know what's causing them. I'm not a doctor, but I've heard rumors that there are doctors on the island. I just haven't found one yet. I if have. If we can find a doctor, that would be. Here's amazing. the thing, though. Here's the thing. We can find a doctor, and we can also try something else too. What about trying to find this ninja character? Maybe you've got some kind Ooh. of herb or something that will help you sleep or at least if you've got something to knock your ass out so you can't, you know, get up and start walking off in the middle of the night or something. I mean, don't ninjas do this whole sen shit and everything? I have no idea. No so idea. maybe if he can te teach me how to be one with the earth or something like that, maybe he can calm my inner 
inner demons, you know? I don't know what you've got going on. I just know that I either need to shackle you to a cave or to the vehicle or something like, oh, by the way, I've got a car. A lot has happened since you've been away. I've, uh, <laughs> I've been doing I've a little bit of exploration. That. Yeah, yeah. So I've got a lot to fill you in on. I'll do that on the drive over there. But basically, there is an MC. Over there. Yeah. Um, if you look on your map, uh, B2 seems to be the central hub of where everything is happening. Dude, I w have you been there all along? Uh, I've been there a couple of days. I've not been staying there, though. That is cr I've been so close to you. Where was you? I was in B3. You see, if you check the map, you can see the red dotted line that goes into this... Uh, the train tracks? The train tracks, yeah. That's where I was. That's <laughs> where I was before I started making my way down here. Go and to then... the road above that, the yellow road, and follow it up mm -hmm. diagonally to the right. Do you see that little town area in B2? That's where I was literally for three days. Wait, that's not the town where uh, the the uh, trade. No, what what do you call that? The uh, the ones uh, there's a bridge with a house on it. That's not there, is it? A bridge with a house. Oh, that might not be it. I think that might be further in B three then. I didn't see a bridge with a house. All I can tell you is that town has been completely overtaken by the MC. Now the good news is okay. <laughs> they're friendly. Um. They set me a couple of tasks to do in order to prove that I was okay. You know, basically like a little trial run. Um, I had to kill a wolf, which I still haven't done, and they wanted its head. And that way they what? would give me the potential to become a prospect. Now, I did tell them about you, and I'm still looking for you, so they do expect you. I just don't know how you're going to take to them. They're not quite what we've been told they are. They're not evil. They're not bad in any way. I don't think they are, anyway, unless they're hiding it. Um, but I've been able to trade a lot with them. Put it this way. I found this car and it was broken. I really needed help fixing mm -hmm. it up. There was two or three people there that were happy to help. And I just made a couple of trades, trade them up for like a car repair kit and stuff like that. You know, everything that I needed. And they fixed that thing up for me. And then what I did, if you look on your map again on B2, top right corner, there's an airfield. You may remember it. <laughs> Went oh, back yeah, over yeah. there. Yeah. And I've picked up a lot of the stuff that we couldn't carry before. So I was able to trade up again. So I'm going to show you what we've got before we uh, before we head out today. So anyway, make uh, but, make friends uh, with the new vehicle. This is our new home. <laughs> and that's this is what amazing, we've got. but I'm a little bit worried. So these guys, the MC, are they... I mean, are they using you for their personal gain? I have no idea. I, uh, I didn't want to stay there too long, purely because uh, I needed to find you. I told them that I was finding you. They're expecting you, by the way. Um, <laughs> so I don't, I don't know. know if... Yeah, I don't. I don't know how you're gonna take this. If you want to have a look through them, I'll uh, I'll I'll quickly scan through what we've got inside of them. What? Um, Dude, yeah. Have you been doing this? Oh yeah. While I've been gone. Yeah, yeah. I've been I've been trying to make sure that if I did meet up with you, if you were in trouble or oh. if we needed any supplies, that we'd have everything we needed. So if you look in the other one, we just got like some clothes and stuff. I kept the shurikens that we found down in the uh, in the bunker that we were in. Also. Oh yeah, I found one of those. Um, can you I pick? Found one. Can you pick this up a second? Don't turn it on yet. Oh, you got a, a lantern. I got two lanterns. Come oh, look here. at that. Yeah, yeah. And I found these. They're actually uh, really easy to find, apparently. You just find them in, like, uh, you know those broken down farmhouses? Mm -hmm. They're in there a lot. So if you want to turn it on. Oh, this is nice. How do I do that? Turn that sucker on on the side. Oh, I can drink out of it? No, you don't want to do that. It's probably got f some kind of fuel in it. But look at this. If we want to explore oh. any caves or if we're traveling at nighttime. I know we're going to be a hot target at night, but... At least we can see this where we're going amazing. now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we got these. Um, I can't remember so, what else. Did you loot all of this or did you get it from the MC? Um, a lot of it is traded up. So everything you're seeing here, a lot of it is traded up. But the majority of like the bits and things that you can see, like, you know, spare bits of clothing and stuff. I found all of that. It wasn't too hard to find. All the okay, weapon you... things in here, I'm happy to trade them. If you want to take anything out of that weapon stuff, have at it, dude. Take anything you want. Um... I got my, uh, I got my this. bat. Look at this. Wait, you got it? Oh, you got it. Yeah, yeah. I remember you talking about that before you left me. Yeah, I got it made by, uh, okay, this is going to be really hard to explain, but there is a character over at the MC called Goblin. Okay, I know how it sounds, but Goblin. yeah, just bear with me a second. He's not entirely human. This island has changed him. What? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Basically, he's a killing machine. <laughs> And he's taken a liking to me. As long as I bring him fish or a cake, he is golden. 
with anything that I ask him to do. He can give me protection if I'm going on a run. He can fix something for me or he can trade items with me. It's just you can't make eye contact him when we first eye contact with him when we first meet. And I have to do the introduction. After that, though, if he if he likes you, then you've got like a, a ready trained dog ready to go. And it's he's lethal too. So a this, dog that can use guns. Yeah. I traded up to this I mean, too. That's not too bad. Have a look at that on the floor there. Oh, what is that M M16? Yeah, yeah. Pick that it up. That's a beauty, isn't it? Have a look at it. Mess around with it a little bit. This is something that Goblin gave me yesterday before I set off to head to you. Now, I don't know what it's entirely made out of. I don't want to know <laughs> if you look around on the floor there. <laughs> um, but I had to take it because I didn't want to say no to him. That is amazing. Well, he seems friendly, but I don't know. I I don't know with new people, dude. Last time I trusted someone, mm -hmm. it, it, I lost my I know. my wife. That was uh, that was my so. thinking behind it. I do have some food as well, so we can we can grub out before we actually head out there while we got a bit of daylight I would love too. Some food. Ranger seems to be the, the the president of the MC, and Alex, my contact, is the VP. Now Ranger did a deal with me where he needed food items and drink and stuff like that because their wells ran dry. And he gave me in exchange this stuff. I'm going to place it on the ground so you can see it. Short. Oh, improvised rails. Yep. These are Rifle all fabricated rail. rails made out of just scrap metal that Dude, you can imagine use. Imagine if you could make that. You can. Wait, we can, what? We can learn how to do it. I think the MC might be able to teach us if we have like uh, anything that they need in exchange. They're happy to do trades. Now, they're not the only traders on the island. They've run into some okay. real sketch stuff with other people. Apparently, there's another one called the Southern Trading Company, which we're, we're going to find out more information about. But I don't want to overload you with too much information. So for now, grab one of those rails, mm -hmm. see if it fits onto the back of your VSS, and I'm going to show you something that's going to blow your mind. Oh, yeah, it does. It does. Okay. One of the rails are on. You got it? Right, check this out. Have you ever had a hunting scope on a VSS? Oh. <laughs> Wait, can I put that on? <laughs> Try it. Oh, no, I can't. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I have that. No, I can't. I can't. It won't go on that one? No. Okay. I don't know if that, what kind of, uh, if it's just like short, it's like um, a side, like holographic side or something. All I'll maybe? say is certain scopes will be able to mount it with those improvised rails. You know the hunter rifle that I had, the 22 caliber one? Uh huh. Well, turns out, you know the M82 scope we found at the airfield for the big old sniper rifle? I mounted oh. that scope onto that rifle. <laughs> No way! <laughs> yeah, now here's the sad news. I actually did something with that MC group called a Killbox. They had a whole bunch of prospects that were getting put under some kind of initiation. I went with them because they promised me a share of the loot. And unfortunately, I get into the Killbox, everything was going well, and then the lights went out. And I had to squeeze out through a vent and I had to leave everything Jesus behind. Christ. I was told by those guys that a laser grid goes inside those things and it just gets rid of everything. So. I was starting fresh. Luckily, I get out of there, though. So that's where we are. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, we're going to pack all this stuff away. Let's get some food and we'll head out. Um, I've been driving for the past few days, so I'm quite well um, equipped to, or I'm familiar with how this car drives. Would you like to drive it? You know what, Mason? I wouldn't. <laughs> because right. <laughs> right now, I'm fresh from a blackout, and um, if we drive, I might black out. Wait, what do you mean you're fresh from a blackout? I thought you... I thought that was a few days ago. It that was, was over a week was, ago. I would say it's, yeah, but it's still fresh. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Blackouts can uh, take... Uh, it's like, I'm still tired, you know? It takes its toll on you? Yeah. It, okay. uh, it drains my energy. Well, I'm going to let you know right now. The gear changes. I'm still not smooth with it. I'm getting used to it, right? So you're only crunching. Don't worry too much about it. Oh, so you're you're one of those that likes to drive an automatic? Are you going to criticize me after you've just said no, no, you no. don't want to drive? No, 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 no. I, uh... I can't believe I I've been away from you for a week and you're already starting up. You know, no, that's not, no, you're taking it the wrong way. So you, are you putting on, putting music on just because I can't hear you, hey, Frank. Speak? This is unbelievable. Oh my God. I've just realized you don't even know about the red zones now, do you? No, I have no clue what's going okay, on. I've, so I've been surviving off the land, you know, it's, I've been out of loop. Here's the 30 second rundown. Basically, we found out, or it seems like the island is evolving in more ways than one. We've heard rumors that people are coming to the island to get control of it again. There's people coming to the island which are going to make things easier for the survivors. But 
if you look on your map, if you're able to open it, mm -hmm. you'll see red zones. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I was thinking about that. What are those doing there? They're being referred to as kill zones. Okay. If you go into a red zone, anything goes. None of the survivors go there to offer protection, just so you know that. If you okay. go in there okay. and eat shit, that's it for you. Why would I go in there and eat shit? Eat shit is an expression, Frank, okay? I didn't physically- Okay. <sighs> okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's it's the language barrier, this, right? The, the, it's, you know, oh, I'm because you're Denmark. Danish? Oh, sw no, it's uh, Sweden. Sweden. Yeah. I'm from Sweden. Can you I've go and take care I of that you. undead thing in the window over okay, there? Okay, alright. Yeah, I'll get it. I'll get it. Thank you. There's a secondary one at the back as well, I think. I'm a little bit worried. I think Ooh, I... whoa, whoa, whoa. That is exactly what? what I've been looking for. I have one on my bed. Did I drop mine? No, no, I have it. You have the same one? Oh, you do. Oh, no, you don't. You have a different one. What is that one you have? S-B-A-S-S. Oh, okay. It's a nice looking one. I like this one, though. I'm going to keep all of this. If that's okay. Yeah, yeah. Take it, take it. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I just want to get my, uh, my Val up and running. Roger, we'll get you some ammunition. Some sodas. Yeah, maybe you can sweet talk them. Well, if uh, if the people that I know are there, I'm sure they'll help me out. I uh, I don't want to burn any bridges with them, but at the same time, I don't technically know them. I know you a little bit more. If that makes sense, that's kind of where I am with it, but they've been friendly to mm -hmm. me so far. They've given me no reason not to trust them, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I, I'm looking at it like this. They have to prove themselves to me. I don't. I have nothing to hide. I have nothing to prove. They're going to be the ones that had to prove they are good peeps to me, you know? Why didn't you tell me I had my fucking skiing mask on? I thought you wanted it on. No, I, I would scare the crap out of them. I, they're not even going to recognize me if I go into there and I have that on. See, it's you, little you things like, like this, Frank, you need to be paying attention to. Yo, listen, listen. You looked like one of those, yeah, what do you call them, uh, mumble rappers. I was, uh, I, I thought you were about to get in the car, thick bars. get okay. in the car, getting in, uh, you have been talking to people a lot because you met a lot of people. You said, yeah, I haven't met anyone. That's why I'm speaking a lot. And, uh, I was chopping up uh, the only ones that I've been talking to. I chopped up these uh, puppets or zombies and I put their parts up on chairs, tables around me when I was about to sleep. Okay. Just to talk to them, not to be lonely. You know, that's weird. Very, very what? weird, Frank. You know that. No, I, I, you, I, you do what you need to cope. That's what you do. Just so you know as well, you know the red zones I was talking about? There's one right to your right-hand side there. Mm -hmm. That area I is like a red that. zone. You go in there, so, uh, anything goes. You can be shot be and killed on site. To, let's say I would position myself up on that, uh, what is that, chimney? Would I be able to shoot people outside of the red zone? I've been told those those red zones have been marked as an area where anything goes. So if you're inside that zone, the the rules, quote unquote rules of the of the island, what people are surviving by, uh, they don't apply. Hmm. So you go in there at your own risk. Okay, okay, I like that. You recognize where we are now? I recognize that. You yeah. Know, this place, yeah. How could I forget? Be aware again, because there's been a few people here the last time I've been through. This is almost where I died, you know? Almost where we both died, where we, uh... They we're... didn't know you were there. You were in a bush. That's true. Oh, somebody's <laughs> been here. Somebody's been here. Oh, dude, watch out, watch I see out. It. I see it's it. one of I see those. It. I see it. Yeah, somebody's been here pretty recent, too. Oh, my God. Look over to up, the left. Wasn't it? Look over to the left. Look how many there are. Oh, dude, I don't like this. They're hitting harder, too. Just so you know. Yeah. It's like they're... Yeah, uh, hold on, we need to stop here. I need you to uh, have a look in those buildings for me real quick. And see if you can find anything like a car battery or stuff like that. Fuel cans we do not need. Fuel cans we don't need, okay? okay. Oh, another one. I can hear the laughter. You can? Yep. It's one on our left. Uh, do you need a hose? Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, no, leave that for now. Anything special you're looking for except car, the battery? Uh, car battery and uh, anything anything like lead plates and stuff. We need to hold on to that. Lead plates are roger. Oh, I hear it now. Yeah, you're right. There is one in the area. 
Yeah, metal scrap. Do we need that? No, 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 no. May take these jumper cables though. Yeah, I'm gonna take the jumper cables just in case we need them for anything. Right, I'm done Nothing with my room. Found, dude. The yeah, the people have been here. Yeah, it's been picked clean, hundred percent. So, Mason, I have a question. Would it be a good idea, because I don't trust these guys, I never met them, would it be a good idea for me to use another name? At the start? Uh, I don't know. Somebody's over to the left, though, with a tractor. You hear that? Oh, I do. Oh, yeah, I see them. They're over there. There's people here, then. So they did oh, find the tractor, up. it sounds like. Heads up. What is it doing? Hello. Hey man, how's it going? Pretty good. Hey, is that you, Mason? That's me, dude. How's it doing? How's things? Pretty good. Be cool, Just, Frank. Uh, be cool, be cool. The area. Uh, question, is Ranger or Alex around? You know, I haven't seen them, so I think they might be out. Okay, you haven't seen them for a while? Yeah, sadly. All right. Um, I'm just going to show uh, my new friend here just what's going on in this area, and uh, I'll be back, okay? Just hang tight. Yeah. You're good. Do you need a repair? Uh, yeah, like I do. I do. Yep. You can help me out with that. We can work something out. Uh, Frank, I'm going to be totally honest. Mm -hmm. I'm there's, just being very quiet. There's people here that I don't remember the names of. There's a lot of them, okay? I'm trying to remember. Somebody told me to, to pull up into a spot where it has, like, a, a garage set up. This person's name is Rebel. He's one of the new prospects. Did you see his face, though? I was about, like, I, I was about to say something, but I, I thought it wouldn't be the right thing to do. Just mention that he has a weird face. A right lot of them don't show their face. A lot of them do not show oh, their face. Oh, all right, all right. Oh, it was a mask he had on, eh? Yeah, yeah. It sounds like there is a farm. This city's booming, dude. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is Rebel Spot. This one here on the right. This is Rebel Spot. He's one of the new prospects. He's helped me out before, too. I'm going to go and check who this is in the tractor. Oh, this car is really struggling. Dude, I'm amazed. I, I, I'm going from being alone and seeing this. It's just crazy to me. Let's go and find out who this is. Rebel, is that you? Yes. Do you mind just cutting the tractor for a second? Hey, buddy, how's things? Um, Rebel, I'm I'm in a little bit of a pickle. I uh, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. This is my new friend. Um, I'm just showing him around the place. Uh, friend, meet Hello. Rebel. Hello. Rebel, meet friend. Hello. Uh, Hello, uh, Rebel. My, my name is si si Sally. Oh, nice to meet you. So here's the deal, though. I uh, I kind of traded my last car repair kits that I had, and I don't really have anything to repair the vehicle with. Is there something we can work out for trade that you will happily take for repairing our vehicle? Uh, yeah. Uh, meet me over at the, uh, the shop, and uh, I'll... Uh... I'll grab one and we'll work out a deal. Roger that. I'll be back with you in about five, maybe ten minutes. Again, I'm just showing my friend around so he knows where the spots are, Rebel, okay? But thank you, man. Okay, you are. Yeah, yeah, Rebel, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I usually don't tell my real name to people that I don't trust, but you seem like an alright fella. There it is. Frank. There it is. Sorry about that. <laughs> nice to meet you, Frank. Uh, Frank, uh, get in the car. We gotta go. Alright. Good, good seeing you, Rebel. I'll see you around. Bye. Okay, so this is the main spot. This is the actual compound, the, uh, the quote-unquote club. Now, before we get anybody out of here, they've had a bit of a problem over the last day or so. Now, you know how I said they're an MC? Mm hmm They don't have any motorcycles. So they're technically just, like, they, they have to lose the M. They're just a C now. They're just, just a club. What, what did he do to Okay. I don't Let know me... who it was. Let me just turn the uh, lights off. Should I should I go and knock on it? I have to beep three times. If you read the signs, to tell me what they say. Beep, beep. No, you, no, you Frank. Tell what? me what the sign says. Oh. 
two prospect openings left. What about the one to the left? Honk three times for service if we're here. Okay, I'll do that then. Oh my lord. Right, that should bring somebody to the front if anybody's there. Now we wait for a couple of minutes, and if anybody is inside, they'll come out and help us. So, what we're trying to do right now is I spoke to Rebel. He's going to be happy to help us. Obviously, he was in the middle of something, but he'll be happy to help us repair the... Are you really trying to start shit with this group? I just told you, they're like 20 strong. Be no, I'm just messing. It's just a joke. It's, you know, like But if that can was to knock somebody out cold, especially the person that I told you about called Goblin, who's a killing machine... <laughs> Anyway, the point being, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. we yeah, need Rebel yeah, yeah. to fix this car because we have a long journey ahead of us, all right? So we need to kind of work out a deal with him. I'm going to leave you in charge of that. Have a look at what we've got of inventory in the back of the car because I've been doing deals with them. I kind of know how they work, but I need you to know this too. Have a look in the back of the car. Okay. While we've got a little bit of time, drag the bags out of the back and work out if there's anything in there that we can trade. Now, remember, we don't really want to give away the stuff that we want to hold on to. So try and get a good deal for us. Your powers of negotiation are key here, okay? All right. I'm going to give them a... Maybe I can give them... Let's see here. What do we have? Give them a knife. We could get... Yeah, dude. A, a bread knife. That's perfect, isn't it? You're going to give them a bread knife for them repairing our car. I mean... If You're going to get a it, shot. You're going to get a shot. Right, we're going to go over to the, the trade depot now. This is basically where they've been operating from. They've been stocking supplies and stuff, so... We're going to pull over oh, here. The oh, there is. Just as I hit them. There we go. Right, go and introduce yourself. Hello. Yo! Yo, Leatherface, how's it going? He called him Leatherface. Hey, Leatherface. It's wood. You hurt my feelings. To do that, I, 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 you know, I'm just nervous around new people. That's all, and uh, I never met no, you before, good. so I, I tried to crack a joke. And if I hurt your feelings, I'm super sorry about that. Nah, you're fine. Uh, sorry, I didn't catch your name though. What was it? Um, Will, or Subject. Most people just call me Subject. I'm oh, it is you, Subject. Exploit. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't recognize I you with the new head. clothes. Subject, I think That's the nice. uh, the motor on that thing is still running. Do you mind jumping in it and turning it off? Because I have this like really weird OCD thing about it. Yeah. Like just move it forward and then stop it just a touch. I think I think that's what it is. I can hear. Yeah. Ah, there you go. That's fixed it. Thank you, man. Yeah, you're good. Who we got here? Is this uh? Really this isn't Rebel, right? Is that you, Rebel? Your clothing looks really different. Yeah, we've had to I, I need change our gear wash, since the torrential you. rainstorms. Ah, uh, okay. All right. Well, uh, Frank, do you want to speak to uh, Rebel about what, we, uh, what we've what we got on offer, or do you want to try and work something out? I'm just going to go and take care of the stuff we've got in the car. Oh, yeah, in the car. yeah we can do that. So, uh, pretty much, we need our car fixed. You can see it's smoking. It's, uh, Mason is not the best driver. He's been uh, putting in the wrong gear and everything like that, you know? It's she goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so with that, would you be able to fix that for... I don't know what you need, but I have some ammunition if you need that. Uh, what kind of ammunition do you have? I think it's called 3006 or something like that. It's for an M1 brand. 30 odd so 6. six. Yeah, okay. that's what I've yeah, been finding yeah. because I've been on, all alone, you know, on the, on the road for, for, for a week before I found Mason and that's pretty much all I have, you know. Yeah, I do have a one grant for sure. Uh, that will be suffice to. Okay, yeah, yeah, vehicle. thank you. Thank you. You're a very kind man. Uh, I can put everything that I have out here on the table, and uh, you can grab it if you want to, if you, if you would like that. That is plenty. That should be good. Hey, Rebel here. I already got one on me. Uh, I had one. It's I want to grab some one left. too. Yeah. Oh, you're good. Use this one. Uh, go ahead and grab that stuff up. And yep. is the vehicle unlocked? Uh, no, no, no. I'll get on that right now. 
Thank you guys. You you, you made me very happy. It's uh, it's so yeah, nice to have a car, and it's it would be nice to have it working. You know, I've been walking. Oh. oh yeah. Is Goblin around? Goblin around? Uh, no. Goblin's no. not right now. Yeah. I mean, if he is, none of us will see him. So. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of owe him a favor, so it'd be nice if I could catch him. Yep, the car is fully repaired. So you can throw your luck back on. Perfect. Thank you, man. You're welcome. Thank you so much. And you already worked oh, something welcome. out, did you, Frank? You already uh, you worked something out for the trade? Yes, he did. I like what you did. You got rid of the um, ammunition that we're not using, which is cool. Good job on that. Yeah, I mean... Yeah, I mean, he had an M1 Grand and he could use that ammo, so it works out. So it's we, all about not giving them them everything, you know? Did we get rid of the 30-06 as well as anything else, or was it just that? that? It was just that. Okay. That's good then. So we freed up a little bit more room as well. We, at some point, we really do need to tidy up what we've got inside the back of this. We're, we're using basic boxes right now that I put a couple of locks mm -hmm. on. Uh, just so you know in the car as well, if you have anything you want to put a lock on, um, feel right. free to use those locks. The issue is, they're really hard to pry them away from the MC. Or for that matter, anybody that's trading them. So, okay. ooh, a roadblock ahead. <gasps> roadblock ahead. Yeah, this is the place. Yep. This is the place. This is where I was. Yep, I know where this is. This is uh, this, this is the person this... that I traded the drill with. Yep, this is the place where I got my uh, my Val. So, I believe this person's name's called Leon. Leon. Yeah, and he runs a toll road. But he does keep it open if you want to go through. Just that's not very smart of him. If he's, he if he wants to get paid, you know. Honk if you're happy. I'll go through slow. Honkly honk. I'm very happy. Open for trade. Take what you need. Leave what okay, you don't. Okay, let's see if we got uh, something more here. I mean, I was lucky once. Nobody's here, right? I don't think so. Okay, we got a couple of weapons in here. Oh, bare feet? Who the f Who puts bare feet in there? A hunter. Oh, Pick look, at th that's human skin. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what is this? Okay, th someone has been through here. That was fully stacked when I was here the last time. I and might now take it's human that metal skin? arrow. What do you think? Should I take that metal arrow? I'm going to take it. Dude, I'm going to leave an old broccoli in here. Yeah? You're going to just leave him an old broccoli? Yeah. As a thank you for for the vowel, you know? Or should I leave him a feather? Yeah. Light as a feather, you know? Light yeah. as a feather. There you go. I'll leave him a feather. Just in case he needs it. And then you have uh, this tent. Right? Uh, <laughs> oh, it's a travel lodge. It's a travel lodge, yeah. And then, <laughs> it's hold up for the night. It's actually a pretty cool idea, to be fair. It's, if you, you know, you're in fine, the, the, uh, you're staying inside these walls and you're safe and... It's better than nothing, I mean, right? Yeah, if they are actually, <laughs> if they are closed in the doors, because... A night under the stars, yeah. Mm. I don't know, I like the idea of that, I just don't know. When I spoke to him, he, he didn't seem to, he was a little bit jumpy, but... I needed to get those toolboxes really bad. That's right. good, it's, it's nice to have people around that uh, can help you out if you need anything. The plan is just to keep... Wait, do we want to go... Yeah, let's just go straight here. Oh, there's a lot of undead in this town. A lot. Yeah, I, the, the thing is, I was going through here to tr tr try to find a vehicle because I wanted a vehicle to be able to find you faster. With the whole MC thing, because they're pretty established now, right? They've got their own little trade outposts and little that area where they're living. What I've saw, the southern I trade can't. outpost is pretty similar. I know those guys are in... No, I, wouldn't, I don't know if I'd say competition for selling things or trading things with them, but I know they're, they're pretty heavily stacked in terms of like firepower and stuff and it might even be vehicles too maybe we should pay those guys a visit and see if they've got a um a vehicle for sale see if they do better trades than the mc because right now i've I only mean, dealt with those guys yeah why not if we can get better deals from them here's the thing as well over. hear me out with this there's nothing saying we can't play both sides right mm -hmm. as long as we're keeping it uh, a secret we should be fine yeah it all works in our benefit. That doesn't sound good. Wait, is that... Did you hear that? Was that a chainsaw? You heard a chainsaw? On the other side of the bridge. There was something that was like... 
Here. You hear it now? Oh, there's a base over there. Oh, we're gonna check it out? Yeah. Oh, to the right, to the right. That's where I hear it. There's oh, a there's a boat. There's no. a boat. There's people on a That's boat. That's a boat! If you uh, flex your F2 muscle, you should be able to wave at them. Ahoy, neighbor! Only one person. Fucking rude, ain't it? Yeah, they didn't want to talk. Should we go and roll up on them, see who they are? I think we should. It is only one, right? Damn, how are your ears mm -hmm. so fine-tuned for that? How did you hear well, that? There's, there's something I can hear. I can hear more noises back here. Wait, wait, quick. We gotta go, we gotta go before he dips. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, he's got like a whole thing. Look at that. He's, he's pulling the boat in there. Yo, dude, I know where this is. I think I can't- no, 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 I don't know where this is. Just ignore me. I usually do, Frank. Why? That? Okay. I just don't like the headaches. You just need to uh, open up your ears and not uh, strain yourself listening to right, me. Let's be careful here. We don't know this guy. Hello? Frank, stay behind the car. Lunatic. He could shoot you at any point. Knock, knock. You know what I think you should do, Frank? Actually go and knock on the door, see if you get an answer. Alright, I'm gonna put my uh, hat on. Do I look, uh, do I look cool? You look really cool. You're all disguised. Yeah? Alright, I'm going. Who goes there? We've just rocked up at this person's house, and he asks him who goes there. He's going to get a shot. Don't go in the water, Frank. Just going to walk around. No sign of him? No, nothing. It's, it's a tractor in here, dude. You want to come over and check it out? I'm just going to see if I can get their attention. Maybe they don't want to be bothered. Just, I mean... That's, yeah, that's... It's, we, we could just leave oh, them be, be careful to be honest. in the water, dude. There's, there's sink spots everywhere in that water oh, where you really? just can't... Yeah, you'll get stuck everywhere. Hello? Anybody home? Should I fire, fire a shot with my shotgun? No, God, no. You want to okay. scare them even more than they are now? No, maybe it's just to have a very bad hearing and it can't hear us. We don't, we don't mean you any harm. We're just passing by and we saw you going up the river, so we thought we'd say hello. See if you got anything to trade. I don't think they want to be bothered. Let's get out of here. Yeah. I think they just want to mind their own business. Wonder if they've made a second door and they slipped out the back. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Just trying to see if uh, there's some, uh, anyone. Like those reeds there, are but... difficult. Like if you if you look at the back of that, those reeds that is behind the the, uh -huh. uh, the the walls, you could easily slip out the back of that. Oh yeah. The thing is, I think he, I don't know because he didn't say hi to us. No, at the he bridge, didn't. No, he just, no. Yeah, he he doesn't want to. Uh, That's fine. Know about anything. Want to be left alone? Can't blame him for that. <laughs> true. True. Can't trust too many people on this place. Let's go. Oh, it would make sense for him to live remotely. I'll take it. Again, though, I don't know if this is it. I was just given a rough idea of where they uh, where they found him. See, this is making me uh, think that it's not here, though, because I don't remember them saying it was near a town. Oh, wait. No, no, they did. They said it was near a town, but it was on the cliff. Yeah, keep going this way. Keep going this way. Um, Try and stay to the right a little bit of this road. Don't go directly into the town, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. You want to hug. You okay. see the hills to our right? If it's going to be Shall anywhere, I guess there? it's going to be over that side somewhere. Oh, yeah. This is close to the ocean, isn't it? Yep. We're, we're literally right at the, uh, the the top left of the island now. 
So I guess anywhere around here, if you see anything that looks like a structure, base. <laughs> Maybe is it... Wait, stop, 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 stop. Found something. Wait, where? Uh, opposite side. Jump out the car a second. Uh, have you got Do your I need binoculars? To turn out? What's that over uh, there? Uh, I haven't got a uh, scope on anything. All right, where are we looking? Uh, look dead in. If you look where I'm pointing, dead in that direction over there. You see something on, on like the side of the mountain? On the hill? Oh yeah. I wait. Oh no, that's a bunker, isn't it? Is it? Do you want to like, hit that first, then, before we keep going? Because we can probably find some good right. stuff in there. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. I see a... Uh, what is that? That's a uh, hunting stand, and to the right of that, that's a bunker. Nice. Right, let's go and check that out, then, and then we can... Because I know it's it's definitely in C4, and that would be right on the very edge of it, right? Like, as if we've just got into C4, so... Uh, sorry, D4, D4. Does it? Do you know if he lives close by the water, or...? No, I honestly don't. I remember the, the person that I spoke to the first time, it was two separate people. The first time was just on the road. I just met this random survivor by a campfire. Told me the story about a ninja. I thought they were joking like everybody else did. And they told me that their encounter was in D4, at the very southern end of D4. Now, there's nothing in the southern mm -hmm. end of D4 apart from where we are now. There's a town, there's some cliffs. The second person told me that they were on the cliffs and that person, or the ninja, was building something. Well, that's a fairly big town as well back there. I mean, it would be... Oh, here we go. Nice, Oh, nice. there's something on top of that. Oh, there Should is. Should we just stop here then? Yep. Let's keep the distance. One thing that I'll tell you about this vehicle, there's a fault on it. If you come to the back of it, um, when you put this thing in park, it actually goes into reverse because the gearbox is broken. So you may have to uh -huh. jump back in and just, like, just put your foot on the gas a little bit to get rid of the uh, reverse lights. I'll do that for you. All right. Have you got anything that can take that thing out? I should be able to take him down with my crossbow. I hit him, so he should be coming this way if he... Oh, no, he shouldn't hurt me. He's well out of range, yeah, yeah. Hit him once, though. Yeah, we can find some good loot in these ones, right? I hope so. I'm just oh, gonna put that's a thick boy. My, uh, my, my stuff inside the vehicle. Some room. I got him. Nice. I'm going to drop the meat. We've got a big, big old bow leg that we can use if we need it. Ah, oh, that's awesome. All right, I feel slightly warm. I need to take my jacket off here. What we'll do is we'll be smart with this. Let's not just hoard everything. We'll take what we need now, because we're at a point now where we can do that, right? Oh, I'm really hot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very, very warm today. I don't know if you can see it, but I still have the uh, the ears that you gave me. You, st you still have them? Yeah. Nice. I uh, I had to get rid of mine oh. because of the uh, what? Look behind you, Mason. On top of that, that's a big structure. That's that's built. Where? Just oh. in front of you. Do you see that? That's huge. Can oh, you... that's a big base, dude. That might be it. Wait. Okay, take my binoculars. Here you go, and check that out. That's definitely a base. That's, that's huge. That's on a cliff too. That's exactly where they that's described it was. It. Is he gonna be home though? Let's go and check. Let's go and get this bunker and then we'll uh, we'll go and check it out. Nice spot though. <laughs> I didn't even think of looking back there from here. <laughs> okay, I got the one on the the top right here. I got my shotgun out. Was there only one? Did you see? Yeah, but there should be more around i feel oh this is I really cool them. looking look at that you drop the one on the top second yeah all right someone is coming in i got it nice 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 underneath or around the back of it i don't know if it's inside i'm gonna get up top uh you got two one from my side you can get up here if you need to yeah coming oh he's got careful yeah, he's, careful careful guy's... Oh my god! One more right here. There we go. Oh yeah, I got, got a revolver, by the way. Oh, you did that! I got oh, it! Oh shit! Look at I this think thing. you told me that you wanted one! Yeah, I got one. I managed to trade it up to one with the ivory grip, too. It's real oh, nice. Oh, that looks sexy. <laughs> Damn. Alright, we've made a lot of nut. Ooh! What's a car 98 bayonet. We'll hold on oh. to those. 
Oh and yeah, the bayonets are really, really good, really strong. I think these are your uh, bolts too, dude. Oh, thank you. We got an M1 flash hider. I'll hold on to it. Okay, nothing around here. Check in this room. Good. You can nothing find yourself found. a Mosin or a Car 98 or something like that. that Usually be... there is weapons around here, but I'm thinking... What is that? If the ninja oh. is uh, that close... I just found an M1 suppressor. Nice, that's huge. I mean, if I can get a scope and stuff for the M1, I'd, I'd definitely rock that. Or if we could get a couple of them for us. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'd love the a car 98. beautiful. I'd love, love, love a car 98. It's something about the, what was like these World War II weapons that just... Nice. Reliable Dude, too, someone, I hope. <laughs> someone dropped the log here. As in, Do you think this is a ninja? Dump? Yeah. Yeah, there's one here too. It's a really curly it looks one. Fresh. Yeah, it's uh, this one is really moist. So this one fresh. is fresh. Yeah. Yeah. The ninja might be. So it looks like the ninja might. If that's the ninja's house or whoever lives there. They've been here. There's a lot of thirty out six, but there's there's not really a lot of Mosin. I'm gonna keep hold of these Mosin rounds then. Right. So what did we come away with there? Um, Mosin rounds. We got an M1 flash hider. Do you want that? I don't think we need that since we just found the suppressor, right? So the ammo. Yeah, no, I don't need it. And yeah, I'll ha I'll hang on to this then. Should we go and see if There's we some. can uh, pay a visit? It might not even be that the ninja's place. All right, let's get uh, get back up there where we were. Oh, a little bit of a jump. I'm actually quite impressed with your driving. Oh, you like it? Yeah, I thought you were going to yeah, be just... ass, but you're not. You you you're fairly competent behind the wheel. I like it. Yeah, I'm just uh, tapping, you know, tapping. Just tap, tap, tap a real. Yeah. That's all you have to do. Oh, I'm a little bit nervous now. Yeah, me too, man. It's, I mean, that compound is big. Do you think they would use Wait, wait, do a right, such? do a right, do a right, do a right, do a right. I want to get a full, full look at the front of this place. The one thing that we don't want to do now is surprise a ninja. <laughs> Oh, we don't want to scare him, yeah. Do a couple of honks so he can hear us coming in. He probably knows we're here, but yeah, there you go. Don't think it's going to end well for anyone if you try and surprise a ninja. Just one honk, honk Oh, more. I don't know if this is where... This doesn't look really ninja-ish, you know? This looks more like a, just a fortified spot, doesn't it? I mean, if it was us and we had that whole city to go through, that this would be a perfect spot. It would be great. Look at that. It's a donkey. One this must... Is... Dude, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. Wait, Read the signs. Welcome to Shet's Lee's Dojo Ninja Supplies. What? One must hold squat position on the Stone of Tranquility for two moons in order to enter. What does oh this mean? Oh my god, I know, what, I know what? what he means. I know what he means. Just, just, just go with it, okay? Just go with it. Are we going to undress? Yep. How much? Uh, I'm going down to my shorts and leaving those on. Yes, before you ask me, I am wearing a battle-ready armor. It's because of storage and it keeps everything in the right place, okay? All right. Okay. Right, I can leave my gloves on, I guess. Oh, does it want us to sit here for two moons? We have to stay here for two... Okay, right. I mean... Do you, how much do you want to meet the ninja? A lot. I don't know if you've ever mastered the art of the squat position, but this is it. Let me show it you. I got it. I got it. Well, this is our so, life for the next two days. Fancy. Very fancy. I mean, we made it to the, uh, to the spot. And for everybody that doubted us saying that there wasn't a ninja, this is your proof. <laughs> Here we go. All right, guys, this is where we're going to end it. As always, if you are enjoying the Scum series, drop a like below. It really helps us out. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you all in the next in one. In the next one. <laughs> if I didn't have to squat here right now.